Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Here is another makeup tutorial. I hope you guys enjoy and don't forget to subscribe and like this video. So let's get started. We are going to start off by using the Flawless Fusion Ultra Flawless Foundation by Laura Mercier. We're gonna apply this with a dry beauty blender. This gives it a little bit more coverage and I like how it turns out. So now we are going to correct our lids with the L'Oreal Infallible Full Wear Concealer. And again, blend that out with the Beauty Blender, Dry Beauty Blender. And we're gonna go right in to the Friendcation Palette by Dose of Colors, which is a collab with Desi and Katie. I'm sure you guys know who they are. And we're going to pick up this shade and just apply it right into our creases and blend that out with this Smith Cosmetics brush. And then we're going to take a smaller crease brush and apply it directly into the crease once again, but this time we're really packing on that color and we are blending it out, going back and forth with this brush and the brush that we used before to apply that first shade. And now we're going to cut our crease, just slightly, nothing too crazy, um, with this colored rain brush that I purchased. It's a really good brush for applying concealer and also applying shadow. Um, and we're going to go in with this very beautiful blue shade. It's kind of like a muted blue. It's not too bright. Very beautiful. Reminds me of jeans basically um so i kind of was inspired by the top that i'm wearing and i'm just applying this color all over my lid or at least on the first three quarters of the lid i'm leaving the outer corner nice and clean because i am going to pick out a darker brown shade and i am going to apply that to my outer crease and I am going to blend that out with this Morphe brush here and just blend that away. Here I am picking up a very shimmery green shadow that's in the same palette. And I'm just picking that up with my finger and applying it to the very center of the lid. I believe that this gave it a really, really nice touch. And I'm just going to blend it out a little bit more, blend out those edges to really make them look, look very fluffy. So here I'm just doing my eyeliner with this Architect Liner by La Splash or LA Splash. And I'm just doing a very simple liner here. Now this is a little trick that I got from It's My Ray Ray. I'm sure that you guys know who she is. Where you just take the lash glue and you apply it right onto your lash line. And then you put on your lash right over it. And that is it, you guys. I absolutely love this little technique. I am so happy that I heard about it. Uh, it's made my life a little bit easier. So here I'm taking the Juvia's Place I Am Magic Concealer and I am correcting my under eye with this. I am liking the concealer. I have had a few issues with it, but I figured out that I just cannot over set it with setting powder as I'm doing here. I'm just picking up very little of the Translucent Setting Powder by Laura Mercier and just setting my under eye. So here I'm taking the Rich Amber Bronzer and I am bronzing my face with this Smith Cosmetics 112 brush, which is one of my favorite brushes ever. It is so versatile. You can use it for many, many things. But here I'm using it to just give my face some color since the foundation does make me look very, very pale. This is my love. I love this product. It's from Charlotte Tilbury, the Hollywood Flawless Filter. I just love that glow. Can you guys see that? That glow that it gives my face. 
I absolutely love it. And now I am going to do my eyebrows. I am just giving it a little bit of color as it does fade out with the foundation application. So I'm just kind of livening them up a little bit, not doing too much to it. So I started off with the brow pencil and then after this I am going to go in with the Gimme Brow which is kind of like a brow pomade, a tinted brow pomade. And I'm going to apply that to the inner corner of my brows and just kind of feather it out. And then I'm going to set it with this setting gel by Benefit Cosmetics as well. And here, this is another Charlotte Tilbury product that I am loving. I am picking up the highlighter shade and I am highlighting my cheekbones and this is the Charlotte Tilbury Glowgasm palette and I believe this is the darker version and I'm picking up over here this very beautiful peachy shimmery blush color I absolutely love the effect that this product has on my skin so you just smile so the apple of your cheeks stick out and you apply that blush right over them here I am taking the Urban Decay Eye Pencil in Mars and I am lining my under eye. And then we take the brown shadows that we applied to our crease and we apply the same shadows to the lower lash line and just blend that out until we have a beautiful blown out lower lash line. This just brings the whole look together. And now I am going to apply mascara to my lower lashes and then we're going to highlight the inner corner of the eye with this beautiful goldy shimmery shade from the same Frenkation palette taking this beautiful shade from my lipstick palette I chose this color because I felt that it really tied the whole look together it is a MAC lipstick. I do not know the name. I'm sorry, you guys. <laughs> but anyways, we are going to set this look with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dewy Set Setting Spray. And that's it, you guys. That is the look for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it and see you guys next time. Bye. Thank you guys for tuning in to this makeup tutorial. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. And I hope you guys subscribe to my channel and press the bell button so like that you guys can be notified whenever I upload a new video. Thanks for watching and see you next time.